Marina. I think people at work are starting to notice there's something between us. Well, it didn't help when you stood up at the staff meeting and said, I want to do it with Nina. <laughs> oh, they asked you if there was any unfinished business. I think I figured out a way to get rid of all this tension. You need to spend the night with me. I'm all yours, Spice Lady. <laughs> but you have to tell me where to stop now, because I have been burned in the past. I don't want you to stop anywhere. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. I wrote this song about three years ago, and I finally get to use it. Attention, everyone. My friend Fez has some wonderful news. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? I did it! Wait, I want to hear this. I did it, who? Oh, wait, Fez, I can't believe you finally lost your virginity. Wait, wait. This isn't like the time you bought a hamster, named it virginity, and then lost it. <laughs> no, this is the real thing. You know, I had a hamster once. I tied him up to a helium balloon with a note, made it all the way to Minnesota. Alive? No, I'm gonna set a dead hamster up in a balloon. <laughs> so, come on, tell us all about it. Okay, well, it was incredible. Nina and I started out kissing in the living room. Then we moved into the bedroom where we undressed. <laughs> and, uh, well, then, then we did it. What? Details, Fez. We need details. Well, our faces didn't line up right, so I kept bumping my chin on her nose. <laughs> and then there were some sounds. What kind of sounds? Well, I would say this. It was not applause. <laughs> there was no romantic music like in the movies, so I had to hum. <laughs> And then Nina told me to stop humming. And uh, then I started again without realizing it. And then she got mad. And then I think she got sad. Oh, well, don't worry, Fess. She probably just felt bad she was doing it with the foreigner. <laughs> and then afterwards, I went into the bathroom and, uh, and cried a little. <laughs> And then I snuck out the back door. Poor Fez. Well, you know, Alisa couldn't have been any worse. I left my underwear in her bathroom. 